Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is Peter's TV. This is the channel that gives latest vibes to the world. Spreading, trading, news and gist about celebrating. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification bell to get notified when we upload new videos. Stay tuned and enjoy. Tinubu has nothing to offer you. Nothing to offer you. What the question you are an answering me or you put across to me? This Hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to Peter's TV. Welcome, you know, Shini Adeli King. <laughs> so, my name is T King, and I'm your superstar host. If this is your first time of being on the channel with us, please do well to like this video, subscribe to this channel, click on the notification bell, and also do well to do what, share with your friends and families. Okay, now this is an exclusive interview. Hmm? Like we had an interview with our Baba again, Prophet Marcos Tibetan, about Nigeria and Tinubu. And the first thing Baba said, when he wanted to ask a question, he said, The question I asked uh, is the question I'm supposed to ask my father. <laughs> and I, just, I said, hey, we, oh, do, do, do. That was not an insult, but it's just the fact. So, he has a lot of things to tell us about Tinubu and even mentioned the things that would be uh, that Tinubu needs from us. That is love. That no matter, he even spoke about Obi too. Spoke about Obi that the way Obi was. That's uh, Obi the, the Labour Party uh, for uh, a presidential candidate in the last just concluded election <clears throat> of February 25th. He talked about is that the way will be entered churches went to Baba Deboe of the Redeemed Christian Church of God, went to Baba Biara of Agbalatura, uh, last season Agbalatura, went to a lot of people, went to Baba Bishop David Oedepo, to go and bamboozle, and then and I sent many ministers of God, now started talking and, you know, gave a lot of prophecies, even when God did not tell them. And then a lot of them also said, okay, well, mm, uh, this is this is what you think you do. This is what you think you do. And he, well, one of the things he said that really got me was when he said that, I mean, Prophet Marcus Tibetan, when he mentioned the fact that uh, that he, 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 there will be a devil. Yes, he used the, he used the word. Said it's a devil issue. The devil went to churches and started uh, seeking for their help. And then he said he was disappointed with some pastors that actually implemented that, like enforced that on their church members that you must vote for this person. Uh, he talked about democracy. He spoke about uh, originally, he said, and one, one thing that he also said to he said, the way we escorted Buari back to Dara. Yeah, that's his hometown, his state of origin. Is uh, his hometown rather? He said it's the same way we were escorting you after eight years back to Bordelon or back to your state. So he said we should just continue to pray instead of just trying to be. He said a lot of things about to be. So don't let me just say everything. Let me let's hear from the other's mouth, like the Oloibos we always see. So in that light, uh, let's start the. Uh, this and then let you enjoy what Baba has to say to us. He said a lot of things. He, he actually implored and begged Nigerians just to love the president. Yeah, he's the president already. Yeah, that is what God wants. So I want us to just love him. Okay, I don't forget that even Tinubu himself talked about about that uh, Baba Debu said he's a father of nations. Okay, let's just run through this. Thank you very much for being so much attentive. Enjoy. God bless you. Uh, the new government is, you are asking me what the Nigerians should be expecting from Tinubu. Tinubu has nothing to offer you. Nothing to offer you. What the question you are an answering me or you put across to me, this is a question you're supposed to put across to your father, hmm. your biological father. Hmm. Before you mort my mother, cross my mother, hmm. these four times having four boys, hmm. Daddy, what are your plans for us? Hmm. So if your father has a solid plan, 
Then you now become an engineer. Then the other day, the pilot. This one is this and that. Because when you look at the book of Exodus, Exodus 2, verse 6 to 10, I didn't think the mother of uh, Moses did not know how to weave baskets. He won't have the knowledge of even putting the, putting the boy, Moses, inside the basket. What we needed from Tinobu is not much. But what Tinobu needed from us is many. Hmm. In what way? This new dispensation, what we want from Tinobu is uh, straightforwardness. He can't finish it. He cannot finish it up. He's not God. He's a human being like you. It's like when you are greeting a pastor or a prophet. Oh, good morning, sir. How are you, sir? Uh, God will use, use you mightily for us. It's a lie. God cannot use anybody mightily. And when you greet anybody, he answer you. That person must be a fool. That pastor is a fool. Because automatically, when the pastor goes to bed in the night, who is doing his work? <laughs> so the only thing you need to tell the, your servants that if they greet you, if somebody greeted me in Sutana, oh, I tell you, that I am going to go to the house and go to the house and go to the house. I will not 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 go to the house. I want pass on Nigeria by Jebi. Don't run that alone. Torisha Olua is Sunday. Sunday they come. Ni ojo Tony ka ya sort of phone. But oba wo Nigeria ni se. Oba de ah church is ela gome wa ro Monday. Program wa be. Oba Tuesday be ela gome jila us on Tuesday. Twenty four hours with Christ. Thank you, sir. Tino Buni time to why you could fail your up. Then come at the Parofarawa. Then come at Lora Rolo, the pastor, you know. A later in the time of Boy Tito. Tishu, Obishu, yet to Bali Walu Church. Tom Ben Doria, what a boy. Tom Ben Doria Biara. Tom Ben Doria. I get it, but it should be one no Kaka force you and it don't matter before. No, no, it's too barbaric. It's too bad. Kushebo, Kushebo. Then he go to a door again, and he come get to answer of your son. Be any top of law, be any be capable to only obey that rule. Only they are converting into Christian war, religious war. Oh, my little bit of everybody, Lord. Oh, my little Johnny, be talking in Bangani. Don't be war. Show to fetch your habit to Jukuni. So, my brother, to come back to your question, Tinubu need a lot of things from us. Tinubu will not live in Oshodi. Tinubu will not live in Abuja. Tinubu will not live in Ibi. Tinubu will not live in in, in, in in Delta. But it's the people of Delta that will take care of Delta. Because if you made a mistake by having a friend as an uh, inspector general of police, you lost your goods in Ore. You said if they refused to return the goods, you made you, 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 you made the noise around the whole place for one day. Then the second day you enter the vehicle, then you go to Abuja to go and tell your schoolmate who is an IG to come and help you look for goods. Before you come back, even the bone of the goat will be in the toilet. So that is that. So, Tinubu expect a lot of things from us. We need to tell Tinubu government the truth. We need to tell the, the government of Tinubu what we can do. Then we should need to tell the government of Tinubu what we can offer. Because somebody who married, who you impregnate, somebody impregnate at the age of uh, 14, she didn't finish school set. She didn't graduate. She didn't go to school. She didn't have brain. Then he said, the pregnancy is accident. <laughs> they took you from Oshun 
to collect hotel. And you didn't fight on the road. When was the man of God said there might be small harsh in the ears of some people, but let me tell you the fact, it is actually the truth. Honestly speaking, like it is the truth. We are the ones to provide security for ourselves. Not totally though. You know, we have uh, security personnel up and down the country. But I believe what Baba tried to talk about is that <laughs> there will be like, he, he even made an analogy and he's going to talk about it himself. Uh, just imagine my friend is the is the IG of the of the police, that's the Inspector General of the Police of the Nigerian Federation. And then I now decide that, okay, um, maybe someone stole one of my goods or one of my files. Then I now decided that, okay, oh, I'm going to go to Abuja to go and report. Now, Baba, don't get, don't get Baba wrong. I'm very sure you, the man of God is not trying to talk that uh, maybe we are not having any security. Uh, we are all security is not available in Nigeria. No, 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 no. It's not like we are not being secured. But at some point, we just have to work for ourselves. Too. Yes, we have to work for ourselves. Too. And that's why people are why people are now deciding to you not know, to just secure themselves and work things out. Because we just have to still help Mr. President. Let's continue. And you get to the hotel. You said the pregnancy is accident. It's not accident. It takes two to tango. So in this dispensation, we need to be able to tell ourselves the truth and tell the number of the truth. That's number one. Then number two. We are the one. Who, we are the one to provide security for ourselves. If anybody comes to these streets, this is a church streets, as a visitor, if I'm strolling the streets, I will see what happened in that street. I will tell the landlord association. I will tell the other people. So we we'll come by Saturday. Somebody wanted to build a house there, and that place we have even highlighted it for filling station or police station. So immediately we have to approach the person who sold this land to you. He said, uh, because uh, nobody sell it for me, but I just find the space. I need a space around the estate. Sorry, sir. You have to pack your gravel and granite and everything and leave. We people living in this CDA wanted to build a police post there. What will he do immediately? He will move. Because it's jointly that we approached him. So when you want, when you when you finish with that, then again, there's another thing in this government is we Nigerians that have to go to farm when Tinubu produce security, confirm the security, then we go to farm, then we go and farm and bring something to our table, not something to Tinubu's table. Oh, new government, I was just laughing. <laughs> but I'm just laughing. Before you know now, the eight year we complete. The way we escorted Buhari to Bunabdi, uh, uh, escort him to Gaura, we still escort him to, uh, to Body Lama. Oh, you want to go to his uh, native land in Oyo? So we should make hail now while the sun is about setting. A new dawn. So what he needs from us is love. We should love him as we love ourselves. We should tell him the truth as we tell the truth to ourselves. And we don't need to have a reckless or sex as everybody doing it do could do anyhow this time around. Maybe uh ah Mulla the fire was it I'm ready to know you want to oh my dad, you will look at the highlight. So if I didn't be a Mr. Tenobu's shoe. We could even allow everybody to write whatever they want and put it in the paper. But if we didn't allow him to do that, no, it is, it's good. But Tinobu is a man like you. Like me, I believe Tinobu is a man like me. I have a wife, he has a wife. I have a, I have a children, and he has a children too. I live in a room, he lives in a room. He has a car, I have a car. <laughs> so, <laughs> we are the same. So, but before we confine the power on him, that was making her edge over me. So we, we jointly voted for him. Go and represent us. We believe you can do this. Because two kings cannot occupy a palace at the same time. So 
Nigeria has a lot many things to offer. To so, it's still based on the truth. Kabara was so thorough, and that is just the Nigerians. Like, we see, have to support our president to pray for him. Oh, even if he's not the candidate of your choice, at least it is, I believe, uh, God wanted him to be there. So, I want us to not just uh, start talking or just leave the people that have gone to court to their tribunal or something. But let, let God just work things out. Then we also should make sure, yes, that's what Baba is trying to say. That's what Prophet Marcos Beto is trying to say. To work towards having a better Nigeria. It won't be only Tinubu. Let's do it together. And then he also wants Tinubu not to let things get into his head. So we've had everything ourselves already. And I'm very sure that we enjoy that wonderful one. <laughs> Thank you very much. Till we meet another day with Baba. My name is Remains King himself, and I'm representing Peter's TV. God bless you. Have a very productive weekend. Yeah, the month is going to an end. May God protect us from all evil and help us uh, till the ending of the year. Ooh, don't worry, we'll go shout for fire. Merry Christmas together and happy new year. God bless you guys.